Alright, what is going on guys? Uh, Midnight Invader here. Today we're going to show the tutorial on how to get your character to sprint. Uh, once again, this is in the category of very basic on Unreal Engine. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to get our character sprinting, but he's also going to have the sprint animation. So last video we made our character um, be our character with the animation starter pack. So right now all we've got is jump and crouch. So we're going to add in sprint. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to our character folder under our animation starter pack. So go to character and under ASP character we want to open this up. And what we're going to do is we're going to right click and we're going to type in shift left shift. We want that. So type in left shift. Um, we also need to get to uh, character if I could top holy cow go to get character movement and we want to drag that out and we want to set max walk speed max walk set max walk speed excuse me sorry about that and um, we're going to control C and control V that so we're just going to copy and paste that so when it's released we want this to go back to normal so we're going to figure we're going to find out what our max walk speed is right now and our max walk speed right here is 270 I'm actually going to up that to 350 so when it's released we know we want our max walk speed to be 350 but when it's pressed Oops. When it's pressed, uh, we can up this to 600. We also want to make our sure our character movement goes into that target. So right now, we should have sprint. So if we hit play, we have sprint. It's going faster. You might not be able to see it, but he's definitely going faster. But what we need to do is we need to add in our sprint animation because we don't want we don't want his animation of sprinting looking the exact same that's why you, it's kind of hard to tell that he's actually sprinting right now but we don't we don't want it to look the same but we want to put in our sprint animation so we're going to go back to our character folder in our animation blueprint and we got our jog we want to open that up this is where our blend space is for the jog now right here on the y-axis range that's set at 270 we know our max sp uh, walk speed is higher than 270 uh, it's actually set at 350 we want to up that to 350 and we want to apply now all these are getting errors that's because um, it's set it was at 270 but now it's up to 350 so we need all we need to do is drag these down and drag them back up. Oh no, we don't want that. Uh. I'll have to fix that here in a minute. Just drag all these down and back up. It's actually going to change my max walk speed, but that's all right. Tutorial purposes, so not that big of a deal. And drag that back up. So now it's set at our our max uh, jog speed or sprint. <laughs> our max walk speed is at 262.5. So we need to get to, in order to get this animation right. We need to go in there and change that. Now you can sit here and play with this and get it right to where you want it to be. But I'm just going to leave it at 262.5. I'm just going to go in here and change it. So the max walk speed 262.5 on that. And also, you want to change it on the character movement 262.5. So now, from 200 to 62 speed to 600 is going to be quite a big of a difference. So compile and save that. And now, all you want to do is you want to find the uh, sprint. Da, 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 da. Sprint auto. Sprint forward rifle. All you want to do is drag that and drop this in the middle at this 350. 
So now if we hit save, we go in. There's our walk. There's our sprint. We now have a sprint animation of holding a rifle. We so jump and all that. So that is about it for this tutorial. Very simple stuff. Um, like I said, if there's anything you guys are needing help with, anything in particular, just send me a PM, post in the comments, and I'll definitely help you out. Anyway, thanks guys for watching.